Hello and happy pancake day! Yay! Or if you're celebrating a different holiday, um, happy Mardi Gras I think it is, or whatever you're celebrating today. I hope you're having a good day and you're eating a lot of food, um, especially pancakes, because obviously it's pancakes themed. Anyway, um, so we are going to play um, some, uh, well I say some, we're going to play a um, cooking pancake game but then I figured we might as well do other um, other breakfast kind of uh, recipes so we've got two other ones um, one's a bit more modernised so we've got that in there as well so uh, yeah also I am going to apologise now if you can hear banging in the background my neighbours are currently doing something and there's nothing I can do about it so I'm very sorry if you can hear that hopefully you won't but yeah um, packet day um, basically this is actually um, a uh, 1000 year tradition um it's been going on for quite some time and basically it was the day it's the day before lent the day before you um basically stop eating or give up something for for um uh for lent so you get like for instance a lot of my friends are giving up chocolate and stuff which i'm not going to do um but basically the reason why it was pancakes is because you wanted to get rid of all the all the food that would tempt you um, for Lent, so a lot of people would scramble together the flour and the eggs and all that stuff um, um, And that would make a pancake. So yeah, that's the reason why they eat pancakes on pancake day um, So yeah enough stupid facts um, Let's just dive straight into the first game Which of course if you watch my channel, you know that I absolutely love Sarah's cooking class So we're gonna make some pancakes with Sarah Okay, so here we are um, Sarah's cooking glass, we're gonna make some great old pancakes. Right, go. Oh, we have four decisions to make. Well, I think we're gonna make all of them. Um, so let's just go with the simple buttermilk pancakes, I think. Right, okay, so you need, oh, that's the wrong door. Flour, perfect. Salt, perfect. Uh, sugar, I'm guessing that is. What is it? Didn't tell me. Uh, and a spoon. Okay, perfect. And then we need another bowl. Baking soda to help that thing rise. We need a whisk. Ah, we need some sugar. Okay, so that's what should I go out. Uh, I don't know what that is. Right, we put the flour in first. Okay, and then we put the sugar in. Perfect. And then we put whatever this is in. And we put some baking soda in. Oh, but we need the spoon first. Is that it? And then we, oh, of course, salt. Salt! And then we whisk it all together. So, pancakes. I am a huge fan of pancakes. Um, where are we putting this? Where are we putting it there? And then we need melted butter. We need some milk. We need some eggs. So, yeah, I'm a big fan of pancakes. I usually go for these ones, which are buttermilk ones. Um, I don't know why. I just do. <laughs> but you know, you can shove a pancake in front of me and I'll be happy, so yeah. Excuse me. <coughs> <coughs> Got a bit of a cold at the moment. That time of year I'm afraid, but that doesn't stop me from eating pancakes. Okay. So I have not I don't think I have. I've never made pancakes from scratch. I always usually get like the pre-made stuff or I just buy the pancakes as they are. Um I live in the UK so there's a lot of um, shops that do ready-made pancakes uh, pretty pretty cheaply <laughs> to say the least um, so I actually had some pancakes this morning because I am actually um, recording this on pancake day um, so yeah I had some pancakes this morning I just had normal buttermilk like the small little um, pancakes with some chocolate sauce on them it was very nice so I imagine I'll probably get out some pancakes later um, when my mum gets home, we'll probably have them like after dinner or something, which would be nice. Put it on. So are we actually gonna? F oh no, we probably won't. Will we flip these? No, we won't flip these in a in a thing. Cause they're on the on the thingy. But um, yeah, I have flipped a pancake though, but I um I don't think I've ever actually made them from scratch before, or at least if I have, someone's done it for me. Um, yeah, it's a shame really because I did free tech. Um, at school, and um, I don't think we ever made pancakes. Don't do food tech at school, kids. It's not fun, <laughs> to say the least. Are we gonna make a few? Sweet. 
I suppose you want to get rid of all that mixture and stuff. So yeah, I have. Uh, so I usually have chocolate syrup, or I have um, chocolate syrup, chocolate sauce, or I have syrup. Um, but uh, the, I think the best pancake I ever had was when I was younger, and I decided to have like an all chocolate pancake. But I had a normal pancake, I put chocolate sauce on it, I put chocolate ice cream in the middle, and then I had like a, a couple of cubes of um, Cadbury's. Uh, Cadbury's normal chocolate, uh, just milk chocolate, and it was so good. Definitely the best pancake I've ever had. But um, I, um, I, uh, me and my friends have this um, kind of like tradition. Who puts maple syrup in a fridge? Um, I oh, know we don't. <laughs> um, what was I saying? Oh yeah, we have this tradition of going to this place um, that sells ice cream. It's uh, it's an ice cream parlor basically. Um, and it sells really good stuff, in, but they also do like pancakes, crepes, um, waffles and stuff like that And they, they do some really good ones. Last time I was there, what did I have? I think I just had normal, a normal crepe with just syrup and strawberries and cream on it. It was really good. So good. Cool. Um, so let's go on to more pancakes and we'll make the banana pancakes next. I am a partial banana fan, so I imagine that like, I quite enjoy these. Just, I don't really mind what people put on pancakes. I was baking some powder. Ah, oh, that makes sense. Okay. Um, yeah, I, I'm not really too fussy when it comes to pancakes. You can front me and I'll probably eat it. <laughs> um, although, I, obviously, I follow those um, those social media pages. Um, oh, peanut butter. Oh, I don't like peanut butter. Maybe I won't like these then. Um, but anyway. Um, Right, okay, so um, an ad just started, decided to randomly um, play in the middle of that, but what was it? I can't even remember what I was talking about now. I know, uh, something about me probably not liking these pancakes, because um, they've got peanut butter on them. I don't like peanut butter, sorry, not a huge fan. <sighs> but yeah, um, pancakes, uh, like, like I said, you can just put anything on a pancake for me. Like, I can go the traditional lemon and sugar. Um, what's the other one? I think strawberries and cream is another one. Um, yeah. Oh, blueberries as well. I think we have the blueberries tonight, so I'm not going to have some pancakes with blueberries. Okay, chopped banana, but that's sliced banana. Okay, I'm not going to question it. Sarah, you know what you're doing, so I shall not question you. Right, okay. So. that in, mix it all together, chocolate pancakes look pretty good, the chocolate chip pancakes, I think that's a recipe on here as well which would be quite fun, okay, perfect, so in this mixture I don't think is represented very well in this game, oh uh, it looks like we're just doing it all on the, um, on, the on a fire thing, on a grill, Fire, so um, no flipping, which is a bit sad. I would love it if there was a game where you could just flip pancakes. If there is, someone let me know. Banana pancakes. I do like a banana. I'm more partial to a banana milkshake, but I think I like pancakes. And then flip them over. Sweet. Cool. These are the quickest pancakes I've ever seen. Oops, didn't need to do that. Put it on there and put that one on there. Brilliant. More cookie spray. I hope it's the light stuff because too much cookie spray is bad for you. <sighs> okay. <laughs> You're using the same image pretty much for both. But what can you do on a good old flash game? Right. It's gonna be done. Turn it off. Perfect. Boom. There we go. So I guess it's time to decorate. Chocolate syrup. I never put chocolate syrup in the in the fridge. It always belongs in the food cupboard. Because otherwise, it's it's harder to pour out. <laughs> cool. And those are the banana ones. Very nice. I do quite like that. I know I wouldn't put peanut butter in because um, I just don't like it. Right, what's the next one? 
Blueberry, sweet, and we've got maple, maple syrup and blueberries. Coolio, right. I think, um, like, strawberries and cream um, pancakes are a tradition from England because we love our strawberries and cream. I mean, you know, Wimbledon season comes on, it's always strawberries and cream. Oh, game is lagging slightly. Um, you know, um, we have um, a dessert called Eaton Mess, which is, I think it's actually originally from Scotland, but we have a we have a dessert which is basically like strawberries and meringue and cream, oh, and loads of berries and stuff, it's so good. Um, but yeah, I, I don't know why it's like traditional for uh, for us to have strawberries and cream at Wimbledon, although don't get me wrong, that's really annoying, you can remind me later. Um, um, what was I talking about? Strawberries and cream. Yeah, I, usually when I have strawberries and cream, I have the meringue, strawberries and cream, so it's not just strawberries and cream, it's, but it's still really good. Um, yeah, but I just don't understand why we have it. Then I know it's an old age tradition that I don't know about. Okay. I have to admit, pancakes are pretty simple to make. Did I make them when I was at uni? I don't think I did, I think I just went out. Oh, that's right, my first year at uni, I actually forgot it was pancake day. So I ran out like at one o'clock um, the night before to go get some um, pancakes and all things. Of course, there was a lot of drunk teenagers on the bus at that time. Buttermilk, ooh, make pancakes really nice. Nice and golden. Okay, dry ingredients. And then we pour it all together, mix it all together. Have our mixture boom down and then we put it on the thing. It's really weird that all these adverts keep happening midway through the game, so that's why there's probably gonna be some really weird cuts in this, but hey ho, what can you do? Right, okay, so we need our blueberries and we need another spoon. Cool. Right, turn it on. Spray. Spray. <laughs> cool. I'm gonna put a mixture on. Spoon. I'm gonna put blueberries on. Sweet. I wish blueberries were that small. It'll so you could fit quite a few <laughs> on a pancake at one time. Usually, you can, I can only fit like three or four on there because um. My pancakes are quite small, <laughs> to say the least. Alright. I've been waiting for some pancakes. Cool. And we're going to make two more. Sweet. Yeah, I'm a, I'm a simpleton. I, I just like plain pancakes. I can eat a plain pancake. I mean, um buttermilk ones I can, but with like, uh, like crepe-like pancakes I guess you can call them. I have to have something on them because otherwise they're just a bit boring I guess. Although um, I eat porridge quite a fair bit and we've got some sauces for that. Um, so maybe I'll try one of those. I think we've got like a low-fat chocolate fudge one which might be quite good. Um, and we've got maple syrup. The maple syrup that we've got is absolutely amazing so maybe I'll try it with that. Who knows? There we go. Perfect. Right, and um, now we need some more blueberries. We need some syrup. Why is the syrup in the fridge? I don't get it. Why do people put sauces in fridges? We don't. Um, maybe it's just harder to get out when it's chilled, I think. Perfect. Right, blueberry pancakes. Done. I only got three sides for that one. That's a bit rude. Alright, on to the last one. Choco chip pancakes. Right, pretty much the same stuff as before. Milk, butter and sugar, um, and flour. All the good stuff. Oh no, we need a plain bowl, don't we? Okay, and we need the eggs. Eggs, I understand why you put them in the fridge. Kind of. Um, right. Crack. Crack. <laughs> it could be like that, oh, oh, what is it? We are number one from, um, Lazy Town. There's that, um, freaking, uh, translate speech one. 
There you go. Crunch! You do that instead. <laughs> if you haven't watched that, you need to go watch it. It's absolutely hilarious. Okay. Perfect. Uh, right, more flour. More of this. Baking powder. Oh, it's not in there. Oh, I did see some uh, some cream though. That's just good. Do do do. Okay, sugar. Uh, need a, a cone bowl and we need a whisk. Why's the whisk up there? Shouldn't it be here? Uh, when I used to work, I used to work in a kitchen, and um, all the tools were like that, just above the grill, which is quite of annoying. Um, but yeah, that, it, it was a good job. Um, Got to eat a lot of the leftover food, so I can't complain. Although, did I work there when I was playing Hate Day? No, I don't think I did. No, because it's always on a Tuesday, isn't it? So, um, no, I never I never really worked there on a, on a Tuesday, unless it was overtime. But I imagine we're at that place now, they've got it's on the go. Although, having said that, they only serve lunch there, so maybe not. Right, chocolate chips. And we need the spoon. Cool, and then we mix it all together. I find it really difficult to make stuff with chocolate chips because I don't feel like you can dispense it properly. Like, you can't have, like, I often, because I make cookies and stuff, when I make cookies with um, chocolate chips or something in them like that, I, I find that some of the cookies, like the cookies at the top, don't have as many. Like, you know, when you get the mixture from the top, I often find that they they don't have as many chips as they do at the one if, if you get the mixture from the bottom, if that makes sense. I suppose because, like, everything falls to the bottom. Although, a trick I did learn at Food Tech is um, if you basically just, like, hit... If you... Right, okay, I'll forgive that advertisement because it was the Beauty and the Beast trailer. Um, but yeah, um, what were you saying about chocolate chips? What was I saying? <laughs> I can't remember now. See, that's why I hate adverts because they make you lose your train of thought. Okay. Perfect. Cool. Cool. I don't know why you keep loading game, but... I don't need you. <laughs> you don't need to. Right, I'm guessing we're gonna make another two. Stack of four. Standard. To be honest, I don't really eat that many pancakes on pancake day. I like I'll have some uh, for breakfast if they're there. I, I did go out yesterday and buy some. Um, and then I imagine we'll probably go have some later. So, but I only I usually have a few. Like I don't really tend to eat as quite as many. Although apparently in Britain. Today is the day where most eggs are used, for obvious reasons. <laughs> oh dear. Oh, I need to check that um, social media page that I follow that has the, like, the art pancakes. Because I imagine they've got something good today. Oh, I have some, some truly amazing ones. Right, cream, whipped cream. I love, love whipped cream on them. On anything, pretty much. Um, okay. I need this. God, so, much, so much clicking. Ah, we need a spoon. Cool. Oh, wrong. Wrong one. Whipped cream does not pour out like that. <laughs> and not as perfectly as that. Like, I usually have whipped cream on hot chocolate and stuff, and it never comes out like that. Perfect. And I only got three stars for that one again. Okay. Right, I think that's all of them, isn't it? That's all of the pancakes. Yeah, that's all the pancakes. Okay, brilliant. So what we're going to do is we're going to pick some a uh, couple more. Um, pancake day <laughs> um, with waffles and pop tarts <laughs> um, so yeah I hope you have a, a great day I hope you enjoy eating loads and loads of good food and um, I will see you for the next themed one which I'm guessing will probably be Easter but I'm not too sure um, 
there might be something before that who knows um right i shall see you next time goodbye